I am I am here on the ancestral homelands of the Anacostan and Piscataway people. And I first want to thank everyone on the call. It's amazing to stand in solidarity with so many fierce Native women and two-spirit people from across the country. My dear sister and my um my friend in Congress, Sharice Davids, Peggy. Flanagan, Holly, Leash, Christina, Libby, Jade, Meller, Allie, and Matea. It's always great to be in the same space as you all. Thank you for all of the work you do every single day. And to all of you who organize this amazing call, I'm told nearly 15 people in less than 48 hours registered. There's nothing our community cannot do. This group, the people on this call, will help deliver for Kamala Harris and the country in November. Our votes are powerful, but we're even more powerful when we volunteer. We're going to need boots on the ground to win in November. Some of you know that I got my start organizing. I would lace up my sneakers, put my child Soma in the car, and hit the road. All over Indian country, all over New Mexico, One day I knocked on an elder's door who said no one had ever knocked on their door before and I, and that, and took the time to help them register to vote. If there's one thing I truly believe is that everybody deserves a conversation, a conversation about our present, a conversation about our future, a conversation of why their voice and their vote is so incredibly important. There's no replacement for the connections we can make with people. If each of us gets out in our communities, talks to people, registers voters, and gets people to the polls, we cannot lose. When we vote, we make a difference. When we knock on doors, make phone calls, and show up to feast days and other community events in our own communities, we make a difference. In 2022, the Native vote flipped House seats stopping a red wave and keeping the Senate. In 2020, the native vote delivered Arizona, Michigan, and other swing states to President Biden. In 2018, the native vote helped us to make history when Sharice Davids and I were elected as the first two native women in Congress. You know we can make a difference in 2024. This is a choice between two visions. Donald Trump wants to take us backward. Kamala Harris is building a future for everyone. Kamala is fighting for a future that strengthens our democracy, protects reproductive freedom, and ensures every person has the opportunity to not just get by, but to get ahead. Donald Trump is a convicted criminal running to enact his extreme and dangerous Project 2025 agenda that would roll back Americans' rights and freedoms, hurt the middle class, and threaten our democracy. We can't go back. So today, I challenge each of you to sign up to volunteer, to talk to your families, to make phone calls, to knock on doors, to get involved in this election year. We can tip the scales up and down the ballot in key Senate races, in local legislative races, and yes, in the presidency. Together, we can do this. I feel so energized. How about all of you? Do you all feel energized? I'm ready to work. I hope you are too. And now back to you, Jenna.